Santa Claus came early. Santa Claus came early. You guys, look what we got. Yeah, boy. Um, oh, don't cut it too deep. They really do try to. Uh, we didn't get a black stick. I was hoping for a black one. Doesn't say Hearst or anything on it. So there's that. Should have a Hearst knob though. They do come with decent instructions. You can see that. see that remove this gasket do not reuse it uh, this has been torn apart for about three days now shifter ball or if they gave me a sand damp there for it too yeah it says Hurst on each side oh, not bad we got those That's for the stick and the ball. for what's in the box here we go that is weird. Comes with that whole mounting plate. Now, I don't want it to smell like gear lube. Oh, sweet. You get a paper gasket this time. Woohoo! I believe it's the NV45. Um, here's the old shifter. It looks damn near identical. Here's the new guy. Ooh. Well, I don't know. I mean, that's definitely taller, you know. So, well, we don't need the old bolts, I don't think. And there's no way these guys are going to fit inside here unless I waller it out. But you avoid warranty if you do that, so don't do that. So basically, you just want to pull that old gasket off right there. Let's get this stinky fella out of the way. Oh, um, old gasket has come off, which that thing is stout, like straight up stout, guys. Um, Set in the box right there. Whew, stinky. Uh, I don't see no. Um, what you call it? Gasket material on there. So, ooh, I almost knocked dirt in there. I gotta be careful. I don't want any contaminants in there. There's already enough metal shavings in there. You know what I mean? Yeah. All right, I'm gonna try and clean this up. Get the gasket on there real quick. So here's the paper gasket. I got a little bit of, well, it's limited slip shit, 8090. Um, it says it has API GL5, which this transmission takes GL4 if I remember correctly, um, I shouldn't mess nothing too much up, should I? I don't know. I need to cut this tip real quick. Give me a sec.
This shit stinks. So don't spill it in your vehicle. Because it really does reek to hell of high heaven. Alright. Got that side done. gets a little off showing it all goofy like I guess it'd be fine that way huh? well I guess I'll make it that way also do not crank these bitches the ones that were in there were only at like 10 foot pounds, not even. Not much, but some. We do have a little bit of a leak. Yeah, she likes it. I think I'm happy about that much. Um, about yay much. Wasn't much at all. But so far, so good. The holes are lining up. Just so you know, I'm like barely gonna crank these down. I'm just gonna snug them up. I don't have a torque wrench that goes to like Newton pounds or whatever. Like, you can see some grease smashing out from the gasket. Oh, uh, this is gonna be dumb. Should get on the other side. Give me a minute. Cheats more. Ow. There you go. just opposite of how you pulled everything off all right uh, can't forget the boot it says not to pull it down too far how are you gonna attach that stick is the stick go hang on let me look at the instructions again hey uh enclosed boot the lower lip uh secure just under the housing lid do not stretch boot downward uh hmm. slightly different than the oe boot pre-installation on some models hmm. yeah oh guys i know it's not the right way to use a tool but Oh my god, that is nice. It almost feels like it's barely in there though. Oh, it's in neutral right now. Oh shit. Hey, we should have put that center council on first, eh? But this just does not feel right. Well, shit. I don't know. But you guys are not going to be able to see most of this show. Because I'm going to start putting most of this shit back in. 
and the cameras is so I don't know what to tell you guys so yeah don't forget your little dust boot um I cut the top line off so I can get this up and through it whatever yeah it is what it is um it still look a little better than what was you still also have that boot right there i don't know if i'm gonna reuse that or not i might cut that too we'll see uh, what size are those <clears throat> i think uh by 16th yeah and i grabbed a couple of more sockets for these guys let's see Oh, it's not that big. Oof. Uh, five eighths almost fits it. It is a little loose in there, but so maybe what's this one? A fifteen? No, it's sixteen. I meant to grab fifteen, but five eighths fits it. Kinda. <laughs> 